Hey everybody, welcome back. If you're new, welcome if you're an oldie but a goodie. And I finally finished my Raven Diamond art. Um, I She's the bride. I don't remember the name of the canvas at the moment. Um, but I wanted to share with you, I love how she turned out. I did change a little thing over here. Over here, let me see if I can find it. Right here. This was all like brownish kind of color and I changed it to, it just didn't look right. It just stood out way too much. You can see in the background, it's kind of a brown, but I went ahead and I changed it. I'm loving the colors. I do, I love the shimmer. Now it's not an AB, that's just the shimmer from the light hitting it. And the only thing though, I'm, I don't know. Okay, if we look, let's look at her face. So if we look at her face, I mean, it's gorgeous. The way you guys are seeing the viewfinder and the camera, and just if you look at it, not in the viewfinder, it came out really, really nice. Um, if you haven't tried Raven Diamond Art yet, check them out. Their artwork comes out, I mean, this is my first one. I have a few more that I'm going to do from them, but it just comes out really nice. These are non-resin drills. They are doing resin drills now, so just to give you guys a look at the drills themselves, how they laid. Now remember, I am a single placer. I um, do not place straight. You can kind of see where some of them are crooked. I just place them on there. I'm not precise. Because to me, again, this is for relaxation and not to be perfect. So, um, hello, Chester. Here, just to give you guys a look at puppies. So there's Chester. Hey, Chester, say hi. He's gotten big, big, big boy. There's Mr. Rumbo Bumbo. Chester's getting really good at listening. Um, he comes downstairs with me to work when I go, so when um, he needs to get away. At nighttime, though, he's one of those doggies. When he's ready to go to bed, he's ready to go to bed. Don't mess with him. Don't bug him. He's out for the night. Uh, he is down for the count. So, yeah. So, just to kind of give you guys a look, if you'll let me get him his length wise. He also likes to go outside. He loves outside. And he likes to just go outside. It's funny, he'll be walking around. And if he hears something, he'll stop. And, like, his tail, almost like a pointer or a hunting dog, will, like, point out. So, Chester, hey, buddy, say hi. So, there's Chester, just to give you guys an update on Chester. His nose is healing really well. Just needs to grow some hair back. Um, go back to the painting. So, um, yeah. So, I mean, there's not much more to say, but what I want to say is when you look at the painting, so you see the two different sides, I did say I like this side, how this side came out better than this side. I know it's weird. I just don't like this. I don't know. It's like all these individual little here and there little blacks. Well, it's not blacks. They're more like a, a, I think they're more like a blue. I just don't like, I don't know. It's just weird to me how that came out like that. But over here... I just think this part, I think those little ones that you see, those miscellaneous ones, I just laid there. And I don't know if they were supposed to be there, but I just like how that side came out. This side came out better. This side is kind of, I don't know, that's strange. Um, if you don't remember, it was 28 colors, very vivid, very green. Um, I'm happy with how it turned out. Now I have to figure out if I'm going to frame it or just put it on a board and then hang it. Anyways, guys, on that note, be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and we'll see you on the flip side. Bye, everybody.